Welcome to the London Humane Society, an organization that has existed in London since 1899. Between the hardworking employees and the dedicated volunteers, the London Humane Society had over 2,000 animals in their care during 2011 alone. Well, the London Humane Society provides animal protection and animal sheltering to all the animals that are associated with the residences in London and Middlesex. We do what we do to protect animals, to try and make the lives better for the, the voiceless, really, right? At the London Humane Society, there can be between 125 and 165 animals in the shelter at one time. They provide shelter, care, food, and water, as well as spending time and socializing with the animals. What I want people to think of when they talk about the London Humane Society or when they think about the London Humane Society or hear about us, that we're out here and we're providing animal protection and animal sheltering that need a home. Whether they need a home and they need care because their owner can no longer care for them, lifestyle changes often impact animals. The mission of the London Humane Society is to improve the lives of animals in our community by providing temporary shelter and appropriate new families for unwanted or cruelly treated animals, and by providing education and advocacy, and by assisting animals in distress. I know once they're here, we're gonna care for them and we're going to manage it and we're gonna get them homes. Um, the other part of it is, you know, when you see animals coming in and, and they haven't been fed and they haven't been cared for, they've got matting, they've got severe fleas, they are hungry, um, they haven't been socialized. You know, it's heartbreaking, and it's hard not just on myself, but it's hard on all of the staff because we want to rectify those situations, and you don't rectify them without being, you know, emotionally impacted yourself. So sometimes it's just that there's a few, there's a few tears shed out here. We're an enforcement agency that uh, goes out, we protect and remove animals from uh, abusive and abandonment uh, situations that are um, not suitable or acceptable, and uh, we are not funded by the government. We normally deal with, uh, the majority of our calls probably deal with cats and dogs. Um, we do branch out and do livestock investigations. We do exotics, whether that's reptiles, snakes, um, we've done some alligators and, and crocodiles, things like that. And we've even removed a lion through the London Humane Society. The revision has made it so that um, when we're looking at a situation where somebody's kicked their dog, we don't have to go and find out what their mindset is and prove that they purposely kicked their dog by changing the legislation and including the section cause offense or cause distress or permit distress it's basically made it where you can't do it period regardless of what your mentality of it is um, a good example that i've thought of before is that if you're driving on the street and you drive through a stop sign it doesn't matter whether you knew the stop sign was there or not you've driven through the stop sign you've committed the offense and so that's what we have now is it doesn't matter whether you meant to do it or not you can't do it the animals that come here are not always coming from abusive situations, but whether they're coming from a cherished environment or one of abuse, neglect and abandonment, we're here for them. We bring them in, we provide them care, medical care, sheltering, food, socialization. The volunteers are here every day, including Christmas and Easter and Thanksgiving, all the holidays, Canada Day too, um, to ensure that the animals get socialized, they get walked, they have their playtime and they see people and get time to, they get time to spend with people. So we want people to think about all the things that we do and that we're here simply by donations. We need people to remember that and hopefully um, open their wallets and open their hearts and help us with fundraisers and make a donation and help us continue to be here to serve this ever increasing need for animals in our community. The London Humane Society is grateful for the generous donations in the past, present and future. They hope you will continue to donate and support them so they can continue to be the voice for those who don't have one. We are so grateful for the support that we receive. We would not be able to be here if we didn't receive the level of support that we do. The animals need your support. We need your support. Thank you so much for all that you do for us. Come, get involved, and be a part of the life-saving initiative. Donate, volunteer, or even adopt a new furry friend. They all need homes, and one of those homes can be yours.